So welcome to Office 365 Lessons. We, today we will talk about how to get 25 E5 Office 365 licenses completely for free, no credit card needed. So yeah, let's go. Who am I? My name is Joe. I'm an Office 365 certified Microsoft professional who makes his living as an IT architect. Today's lessons will include an overview of Office 365 subscription, an overview of the basic Office 365 features, an overview of the Office 365 development program, an overview of the E5 tenant, and of course my pro tip, how to get Office Pro Plus installer completely for free, so stay tuned. So first we go to office.com. In office.com, Word, Excel, PowerPoint, OneNote, OneDrive, Outlook, and Teams, completely for free as a web client, if you would want to pay money, then you can even get the installers on your computer. However, it will cost you $99 a year for your family or for your personal account, $69. The cool stuff really come with Office for Business. Here, you don't only get the personal um, Office applications, but you get the very interesting features like Teams, OneDrive, SharePoint, um, Azure Information Protection, and many, many, many other cool features, uh, which we will discuss in the following videos. So subscribe to the channel and let's check it out. The good thing is you can actually get it one month for free. You can sign up here, put your email address. However, it will require a credit card, but don't worry if you cancel early enough, you will not be charged, but be sure to cancel it. To avoid a credit card, we can write over. First of all, you will need an Office account. So you create an account. So I will just sign in. Once you created an account, you signed in, you will have the Office 365 web application completely for free. Here you have an exchange uh, uh, outlook where you can get your emails, a OneDrive where you can store your files and some other cool web applications, uh, Office web applications. So, just a quick overview, you can create an email here. Here you can store your personal data. You can also do some Office Word applications, some Excel spreadsheets, some PowerPoint presentation, all web-based. So that's pretty cool and for free. Once you have the account, you can go to the developer Microsoft program. And here you can see that Microsoft is offering um, a program where you can help to develop. So let's learn more. Once we go in it, you see that they offer 25 E5 subscription, which is the most expensive subscription completely for free. And the best thing, no credit card is required. So let's join it. So we already created an account, so I will log in. Once you sign in, <coughs> the Microsoft program will ask you to fill out some basic information. So let's just fill it in really quick. Then information will be asked, so and we will select some topics that are interesting for us. And there we go, we signed in. And here now we can develop really cool features with the Microsoft um, a development program. And we can also set up an Office 365 E5 subscription. So we will just go ahead and order mm -hmm. one. From where I have to hide, blah, blah, blah. I got the code. And there we go, we have an Office 365 subscription. And here we could create some test users, some events and some test SharePoints. Let's go ahead and create some uh, test users. It will ask for some permissions. So we sign in with our account, give the API um, access to it so it can create our test users, add some custom password for our test users. So let me go and add it right there. And there we go some test users are provisioned. So let's jump into our tenant. Now we are starting the first time the Office 365 E5 tenant. And as you can see, it has now the extra admin um, center where we can basically set all the features for Office 365. Here we can look at some cool, cool things. For instance, we have SharePoint. We have no site provisioned at the moment, so it's empty. But as you can see, we can, for instance, go to the default site and it's fully usable. You could create some new lists, events, and everything on it. Pretty cool. 
let's check some more. We also have Exchange Teams, won't go into it, and the Compliance Center, where I definitely will create some more videos. This is a very interesting part. Here we have things like information protection, e-discovery, records management, and many, many more cool features. So stay tuned. And we also get, with the subscription, the um, account in the Azure portal, because every Azure portal is connected with Office 365. And here you can see, technically speaking, where your users are created in the so-called Azure AD. However, you can also set all the account settings in Office 365 over the ribbon or over the context menu. And there you can basically edit uh, the user however you need it. And we could create a new user. Let's create one really quick, just so you see how easy it would be to create a new user. Send him the password. And here we see we have a very powerful license we can assign to the user with all the cool features that is really expensive to buy. We have added no credit card and have every, all these features for completely free. So that's pretty nice. And now as promised my pro tip, on Office 365, if you sign in with your account, you can go to settings, click on Office apps, and here you can install Office Pro Plus, the installer completely for free for each of your users. So that's a fantastic feature I would definitely use 